allow the virus to replicate. The Ebola virus has been spreading like a wildfire and the death toll has reached 2,500. It is said if there is no immediate and intense intervention, the outbreak could infect 20,000 people in the next three months. Meanwhile, the Middle East has also been struggling with its own complications. Thousands have been displaced and left homeless due to bombardments by Israel. The death toll in Gaza has reached 2,133. According to the Permanent Secretary of the Information Ministry, it's therefore befitting for Namibia to lend a helping hand. The President in Cabinet saw it fitting to make humble donations to the cause of fighting and averting the dangers of the Ebola virus in West African countries and consequently also paying heed uh, to the cries of our uh, brothers and sisters in the Palestinian state, uh, particularly the Gaza Strip, uh, with um, uh, a token of support uh, for the destruction, the pain, uh, the, 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 the reconstruction in the Gaza Strip after Israeli bombardment of innocent and defenseless children, women and uh, the communities. Critics have already come forth stating that Namibia has its own problems, thereby these gestures are potentially a waste of resources, Wanjerikana responded. Yesterday Namibia's house was in, in, in fire when we, were, when we languished under the yoke of colonialism. We are supporting citizens of the world that came to our aid during our time of need and we are just giving back what we received. The World Health Organization estimates that an equivalent of 6.6 .6 billion Namibia dollars is needed to fight the epidemic of the Ebola virus. Jenny Sitole reporting for the News on One.